What's going on everybody? Noah back here with another YouTube video. Here today bring you all some more Call of Duty Mobile to the channel. We just got a brand new store update and it brought in one of the most exciting crates that we've had in a while. And that is going to be the Snake Bite crate, which contains the AK-117, but more importantly, the GKS Snake Bite. This is the first GKS skin that we've seen since it was originally introduced into the Lucky Draw. So that's pretty sick i love this weapon i've made a good bit of videos on this gun so i'm happy that we finally have another version of it being introduced into the game and we're gonna go ahead and make our best attempts at pulling this weapon so i just bought a hundred dollars in cp i have it there in the top right corner you guys can see it sitting in my bank let's go ahead and start spending some of it and see how many pulls it takes for us to get this new gks snake bite i'm really hoping that for once in our life we get it in the first pull no, that's the knife moss. Type 25 moss, okay. We gotta stop with these, like, black screens while it's loading in because it's really throwing me off. It's making me feel like it's that epic loading animation, which it wasn't. We weren't able to get it there in our first 10. Let's see what we can do here in our second 10. MW11. Type 25, and unfortunately still no epics coming out of that. It's all good. Crates. Number three, absolutely nothing there, all common items. So we're going to keep moving forward with our fourth attempt. And we got another knife moss as well as an MW11. So no luck moving on here to a six. Still getting that knife. Got our first epic, and it's a flashbang. So I'll go ahead and take that and uh, keep on moving forward. We are just mowing through this $100. ASM 10 Moss. And there it is. Luckily, it's the GKS2. We got it. The Epic Snake Bite GKS. Woo! I'll take that. Anything else here in this crate? We got another Epic, the Sticky Grenade. And in the same crate, the AK-117. Oh my gosh. That was by far the luckiest crate i think i've ever pulled in cod mobile we got two of the epic weapons and then of course the epic frag grenade for three epics in one 10 pull i was not expecting to get that 117 i was just fine taking the gks and calling it for the crate openings wow that is incredible we ran through half of our cp but we did manage to pull both of the epic items here in this crate. Unfortunately, we didn't get the SMRS, which I'm not too worried about anyway. So what we're going to go ahead and do is equip this GKS now and hop on into some ranked matches. And here's the loadout that we're going to be rocking in today's gameplay. Now, of course, we've got the GKS Snake Bite equipped with the Extended Mag, Foregrip, and Quick Draw. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is hop on into a solo legendary queue, and I'll see you all as soon as we find ourselves a matchup. And it is a Christmas miracle because I just got a domination game on Summit. I had streamed earlier today for like four and a half hours, and I only got three domination matches in that entire four and a half hours stream. So this is some good luck, and I'm feeling pretty good because we're also coming off of a hot DLQ33 Red Action Nuke. If you guys want to see that gameplay, it will be dropping after this one. So make sure to go ahead and subscribe to the channel and turn on the bell notification. That way you get an alert every time I post a new video. With that being said, we've got just a few seconds until we're hopping into this matchup. So of course, we are getting our first look at this GKS skin. It doesn't look like the actual weapon itself is going to be changing at all. So it's just sort of a new animated skin on the weapon, which is always a good thing to see. I really do love the design of this, that snake. It's kind of uh, interesting and unique. But with that being said, let's see what we can do here with the GKS. It's actually one of, like, in my opinion, one of the most underrated SMGs in the game for its accuracy, damage, and just consistency all around. Taking out one player at range, looking around for this other who was patrolling the middle of the map. We got two here, actually. Taking out one of them, I'll go ahead and fall back at this reload and just keep trying to defend my teammates over at C. Yep, there we go. We're just one kill away from a UAV. We've got it. Go ahead and call it on in. Let's see if we can get a little spawn trap going. One of my teammates actually spawned behind these two opponents at A. I'm going to try to take them out if I can. I'm going to avoid the flag for now. That way we still have the element of surprise. I'm going to try to knock this guy off. 
a little bit of desync going on. Got two players on B. You're taking one. Getting the other just seconds before they actually cap that flag. Another one's hopping on it again. Go ahead and spray up like crazy. Try to play my life. Stay alive. We got one. There's another player. One hit. We're going to slide around this corner. Teammates actually cleaning that one up. I'm going to go ahead and drop this shock RC and throw up a counter UAV. I've only got 10 shots here, so i got to make them count. There goes one. Teammates cleaning up the other with a grenade. Oh my gosh, how are we still alive right now? This is some insane luck. I have to go ahead and climb up. Got some good positioning now. Is this player up top with me? No, no, he's down low. Nope, psych. He is up top. Oh my gosh. Okay, shock RC. Counter UAV. I'm on a 10 kill streak, but I've got like no ammo left in my magazine. 22 shots plus one. Oh, and we are just running that dry even more. Opponents are spawning up over here, so let me just go ahead and drop a trip mine down. And uh, yikes. I gotta fall back. Shooting some hives out because I'm just that desperate. Huh! Come on. There's a player behind me. I got him hived up. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. We are still alive. I've got no ammo. There's a player on B like hunting me down. Okay. Sorry, GKS. I love you, but I have to replace you. I've got nothing. <laughs> this is what I get for rocking ghosts and not scavenger. I'm gonna go ahead and push up here towards A. There's a lot of players next to me considering they are spawning up over here. So I'm kind of on a flank at the moment. Go ahead and take out this one. Good. There's going to be one more coming around. I'm going to try to just keep falling back and playing my cover. Okay. Let me throw up this counter UAV. Drop a shock drone. And just get prepared for opponents. Yes, shock RC actually taking that one. I'm not mad because I am still staying alive. A UAV right now would be so incredibly helpful. Okay. Okay. We just got a Ruthless Metal again for some reason. I'm going to just stay here in the corner. Because I know this guy's hunting me down. Oh my gosh, I'm falling back. They can have me, I don't care. I'm just waiting for this dang round to end. Oh. <laughs> I'm staying alive. I'm currently 17-0. and 0. Oh my gosh, I don't know how we're going to play this next round. I know my highs also got a good bit of kills as well. So I'm more than like five off of the nuke for sure. We'll go ahead and get this A flag cap. That way we can go ahead and get that UAV. We'll try to play it. I do want to keep high ground. Got two players on the radar about to push here. Go ahead and take out one. We got another one at B. Go ahead and take him out as well. There's another player on the B flag at the moment. I got a counter UAV. We'll go ahead and toss that into the sky. Drop this shock drone. And it looks like opponents are spawning here at A. Oh, and unfortunately, I did throw the nuke streak. I was just trying to get to my cover there, and it's so unfortunate that I was just strafing too fast, and I wasn't really, like, countering that strafe speed. Oh, okay, 20 and 0 start, though. Not bad at all for our first time using this GKS in quite a while. Let's go ahead and start playing a little more aggressive now and see if we can get a nice high kill game. Got a lot of players here on the radar below me. There goes one. Come on, get the player with ghosts. Nice stuff. Got myself a UAV. We'll go ahead and toss that into the sky. Drop another shock drone. We're about to start getting pushed by a lot of players. Let me actually shoot out the hives. See if a couple of players walk into them, maybe. I've got them all around that doorway. There goes one player. Come on, come on. Waiting for this guy to push. Oh, I got him one hit. He is not going to continue to push forward. So you know what? I'm going to go ahead and try to get into their spawn point. Got teammates around us. VTOL worship from our squad. Oh my gosh. Okay. Count of UAV going up. I'm literally in their base right now. Let's go ahead and flank this player here. Got him weak. Cleaning him on up. And oh my gosh. You can just see the consistency of the GKS. This is what I'm talking about, man. It's just one of the best SMGs in the game. It's got like no recoil. It's a pretty decent weapon when it comes to like all around ranges. It's one of my favorite. See if the opponents are still spawning over here. Yeah, we got one. Go ahead and take them on out. We got ourselves another UAV. Throw that into the sky. And uh, I can see that we got some players on B trying to cap the flag. Oh, taking them on out. Actually, right before he did get that flag cap. That kill actually did bring us up here to this merciless kill streak. And we're going to continue to go ahead and slay out. And I've got no ammo in the GKS again. We just keep running it every time with this weapon. Down to just the revolver. I got a lot of players in front of me. There goes one and two. Oh my goodness. Why are we popping off as hard as we are right now? What is this? What a good game. Hold on. What was our final score? It has to be like 30 something and one. That one very unfortunate death just because, again, I was like strafing too fast. And I wasn't really countering it with my aim. 
That's what I get for my lack of experience with SMGs, to be honest. In case you guys haven't already noticed, I mainly use ARs when I play this game. Oh man, I definitely feel like we can get a nuke though if we have another go at domination. Either way, that was still a fantastic match, plus 63 points, and I gotta see what this final score is. 33 and 1 with a 31%, almost 32% accuracy. The GKS, it's insane, bro. No recoil, very easy to handle. Let's go ahead and find ourselves another, though, and see what we can do in the next one. And it looks like we're making our way back here to some more search and destroy. I'm grateful for that domination match that we ended up having. At least we had a really good game. It was so unfortunate that we weren't able to get the nuke. But regardless, I hope you all did enjoy that first matchup. Here we go, game number two. Some Tunisia search and destroy. One of the best S&D maps, in my opinion, in the entire game. I'm going to go ahead and get aggressive on him. Didn't see anybody initially watching over there, but I do hear this guy pushing in, so we'll go ahead and play him, taking him on out for kill number one. Second one with him, taking them on out as well. Nice little double kill. Go ahead and toss this trip mine over here as like a little bit of insurance in case I get pushed. It sounds like another person is going to whine. They're not using dead silence for some reason. Is he going to try to watch the flank? I got a lot of good shots down on him. Go ahead and keep him suppressed. And I'm going to push around this way on the back end. Cleaning them on up for our third kill of the round. Just looking around for this final player. Where are they at? It's a 2v1 situation. My teammate's following me up. I think this last guy actually might wrap around towards A. Yep, that's exactly what he did. And unfortunately, he was able to outgun me with the KN. And we picked up bomb. We got 30 seconds here for the plant to go down. I believe our teammate is rotating in the right spot. Eyes on. Did he see him? It looks like he did. Movement on point, getting closer, and unfortunately missing the shotgun shot. We ended up losing that round despite my three kills. We're going to have to actually put on the sweatpants real quick because I think we're going to have to earn this victory if we really want it. I'm tempted to like push up mid and see if anybody's countering this with a snipe. It's risky, but I'm going to go for it. We got, oh my gosh, like three players. Go ahead and put that trip mine right there. Yeah, that KN player is still hanging out. Gun in one. Got away with our life. I'm not going to go ahead and overextend just because that's definitely a mistake. Try to close some of this distance over at A. I hear another player at the winery. I'm still hearing those footsteps. They're pushing down towards A. Fighting my teammates right now. Took out one of them. There we go. We got one. Making that trade. Teammate, let's go. Last guy's hanging out over here. Yep, I heard the slide. Got some good shots down, teammate. I'm waiting for the backup. I'll go ahead and rotate, create a little bit of distance here. Getting that player to fall back. Beaming him quite a bit. We've got him down to just one bullet, one HP. Still waiting on my teammates to help me out here. I'm just going to sit back and defend. Yes, there we go. Finally, the support coming on in, and we close out the second round one to one. Well, unfortunately, all the work we did to win the second round just got erased because we lost the third, and we're currently down two to one. Let's see if we can bring it back here to a tied game in this round. I'm going to go ahead and play A. This actually might be a B push. We had one player over there defending, and they actually just got knocked down. Unfortunately, both of our teammates just went down. We're in a 2v1 situation. That trip mine hit marker does let me know exactly where these last two players are, though. They are pushing A. Anybody dropping the bomb? I just shot too early. I'm not facing the consequence, though. Luckily, I was still able to get that clean up. Enemy's picking back up the bomb. Does he go for the plant? Yes, he does. GG's cleaning that up, man. 2-2. Two, two. It's a close game. We're going to have to keep slaying out. Give me that bomb. Our team looks like they all want to go to A, so I'm down to do it. We're going to drop this trip mine down to watch the flank. Unfortunately, another one of our teammates is going down. We're in a 4v4 situation right now. Looks like we do have A control, so I'm going to go ahead and drop this trophy and the bomb. Hopefully. Watching my left side, not getting peeked. This is good. Teammate watching over there. Yeah, we've got a pretty good layout right now. I think we should be able to win this round easy. Nice, huge double kill coming out of Walker. Trip mine, did just get a hit marker. Means this player's hanging out over here. Teammate unfortunately not able to win that gunfight, but if this guy pushes forward, I should have him. He's on the flank. 
Took out my teammate, but it's not going to matter. Round is over, and I got the kill anyway. GG's. 3-2. to two, We're finally in the lead for the first time this game. That was quite the uneventful round for me, but I'll take the dub, man. We got the bomb down. That's all that matters. Teammate picking it up this time, and it looks like we're going to be heading towards B, so let me go ahead and tell the squad to rush B. We're going to toss another trip mine down. They haven't been getting kills, but they've been giving me the awareness I need. Enemies are actually pushing this hard. Got this opponent kind of pinned down. There we go, cleaning that kill on up, bringing this back to a 4v4 situation. I don't really want to like push forward considering the fact that I am using an SMG. Might be some AR players watching these angles. Oh yeah, there's a guy up top and that is a very difficult spot to gun with an SMG. I'm just gonna have to leave the bomb there for now and start working on a flank. Oh, there's two right here. Able to take out one. We got the other player weak. And cleaning him on up for a nice little double kill. We are in a 3v1 situation. Final opponent is near. He's on the balcony right now. I'm going to start working on a flank, but my teammates should run into him any second now. They're spraying shots down left and right. And closing that out. 4-2. to two. We are just one round away from cleaning this game up. Give me that bomb. Thank you very much. I'm going to get aggressive. I'm going to try to push mid and see what we run into. Oh, there's a couple players watching. Yikes. Okay, I'm kind of pinned down with like no teammate support at the moment. Just fighting this KN player. This dude's actually been popping off this whole round. I've got him very weak. And finally closing him on out. There's another one actually eyeballing me now. He actually might be flanking me from down low now. A lot of good shots. I got a lot of players next to me, unfortunately. I'm in a pretty good position. I'm down. Need backup. Listen around for these footsteps. Player real close. I'm actually on the flank right now. There we go. Closing that out, and that is gonna go ahead and do it here for the matchup 5-2 victory baby that's what i'm talking about good game squad pulling through with that mvp title 1400 points and gaining ourselves 61 xp all right well that's gonna go ahead and do it here for today's video if you all did enjoy i would really appreciate if you went ahead and smash that like button let's go for 6500 on this one and let me know in the comment section below what you all think of this new gks skin as i talked about a little bit in the intro the only other time the gks was available in the game was during its initial release when you could get the lucky draw version or the non-skin version during the event since then there's been no other way to unlock the weapon so the gks is back for the second time so if you guys don't already have it i would definitely recommend you know doing a couple of pulls and seeing if you could get it i would say it's sort of like the icr of submachine guns but with a little more damage and uh honestly i really do enjoy using it so i think you guys would all too if you haven't already tried it out i would definitely recommend it but with all that being said that is going to go ahead and do it for me and i will catch you all in the next one